See you in the next one. Proper store is supposed to start at the beginning. Ain't so simple with this one. Now here's a kid whose whole world got all twisted, leaving him stranded on a rock in the sky. He gets up, sets off for the bastion, where everyone agreed to go in case of trouble. ground forms up under his feet as it pointing away. He don't stop to wonder why. Finds his lifelong friend just lying in the room. Well, it's a touching reunion. He sees what's left of the rippling walls. Years of work undone in an instant. In the calamity. That a survivor? No, ma'am. It's a gas fella, forced out from underground. Kid pops it good. Kid just rages for a while. An old repeater falls out of the sky. Ain't a gift from the gods, but it'll have to do. Got a holder still to spin up the chamber. Kids worked up quite a thirst by now, so that fountain looks real inviting. Sometimes you just need a drink. A school of squirts tunnels up around them. Must have fled here from the mines. He sets foot inside one of Selandia's famous watering holes. Wait, haven't I? Anyway, Bondi's place just brings back memories. And then Kid finds his trusty shield. Bondi always wanted his ashes scattered here. But just as he's getting a handle on it, the security takes him for a petty thief. Clang! Shield saves his hide. Windbags start turning up for last call. More squirts start coming out of the woodwork. Big old fella pops out in front of the kid. The kid sees the weight of the bastion out the window. It's a bit of a drop. a good look at things on his way down. He lands on top of a breaker's bow, and it ain't broke. Kid spies a good perch for some target practice. The kid pockets a memento from a breaker, once the fastest man in the land. Uh, 
Good news is the emergency defenses still work. Bad news is they aim it from kid. Sip of the spirits in that distillery, and the kid'll feel like a new man. Some of them squirts birthing like crazy in a couple of corn bins. <laughs> Sends the kid on his way. The bastion's real close now. And then he falls to his death. I'm just fooling. Kid better watch his step. Takes a chunk of alloy, smell of barley and spoiled blueberries fills the air. Scumbags. He robs a scumbag of his last meal. Kid maybe shouldn't have done what he just did. Kid puts him out of his misery. City's heart. Might as well. Kid has a feeling he better get a move on. 
face is stunned to fall. Kid just keeps running. Somersaulting like crazy. At last, the skyway is in sight. And it whisks him where it needs to go. Now the kid sees something stranger still. His mind races. Did anybody else survive? Sure enough, he finds another. He finds me. We talk for a spell. There's a bit of the Bastion's power in that crest. Enough to point the way to the cores. All I tell him is to set that core is on the monument there. Then watch. All right then. Don't answer me. And just like that, the bastion comes alive. Starts growing again. Growing stronger. Kid's gotta put its power to good use. Now the bastion can send him even farther into the wild unknown. Get ponders what to build. The lost and found. Here, kid takes fragments of the old world and makes them whole again. Seems odd to be here. All it takes is some fragments, and the bastion makes it good as new. I tried to let the kid down gently. This is the bastion, all right. Except no one else showed up. The kid don't know what's out there waiting for him. Well, off to the workmen. The workmen ward. Them windbags used to keep the city humming along here. Now he lands at the intersection between bad and wrong. Hey, but which way is bad and which way is wrong? Ought to be a core down one of these twisted streets. But which one? He heads for the squirt steps. Won't be no field trip this time. He's come back and digest just about anything. Except for this. It's quick for slicing and light enough to throw. <laughs> They say even the most rambunctious squirts can be tamed. No sign of the core here. At least the kid got something for his trouble. Them squirts just don't know when to quit. Some scumbags still feeding off the city's own trash. Up north is where the gas fella foreman used to live. Tending to his flock. No white gas fellas all dressed alike. Kids wondering the same thing. side streets before leaving this hole. He heads for the east side, where windbags used to keep the local forge. Inside the forge, Key can fine-tune those instruments of his. When you 
got a solid balance. You've got what you need. comes back, just like I knew he would. The core hums in his pack. The monument's calling for it. The windbags used to be all right. Then the calamity took the floor out from under him. Kid does it again. Only fair he decides what we build next. The Calamity saved some of my old books. Guess it's got a sense of humor. Yes, very weird sense of humor, perhaps. The Memorial. Here yeah, kid can pay respect to the old world and earn it in kind. The Valediction. Just another one of my sketches. Nothing more. of oath and abandon. Make a promise, and the chastened name will lead to it. needs spreading. C is for 
core. A perfect bit of stone found deep underground. It makes the city shine day and night. Is there anything it can do? Dreadrum, a potent spirit brewed from a foul-smelling plant that grows in the wilds. One taste will sharpen your senses. Stay calm, leave your belongings, and make your way to the nearest safe haven. across the land, dedicated to the pioneering spirit of Ceylandia. <laughs> Thank you. 
the god of health and atrophy. We each have the Tower Keeper's strength in us, until that strength runs out. <laughs> Picked up traces of other cores while the kid was out. The melting pot. Place hoarded all sorts of fineries from beyond the boundless sea. The sundown path. Lovely place for a stroll. Before the calamity, that is. Yeah, apocalypses tend to ruin the tourist destinations. Let's not go there. In better days, the melting pot was sealed tighter than the skin on the squirt. Inside one of those fancy cages. Some of the stuff lying around is downright dangerous. He throws a switch. Now, what could possibly go wrong? Quite a bit, as it turns out. The cage starts lifting from the core ever so slow. All kid can do is wait. Shipments start falling in. Not every squirt's born bad. Some spring to the kid's defense. Judging by the movement of the cage, it's gonna take a little while. shows up. It ain't all bad, as the kid finds some spices from the motherland, tax-free. One thing's for sure, that cage is awful heavy.
eight, seven. You can take a few seconds. Five seconds. Course within reach. And done. He's got it. Just gotta get to the nearest bar. I still remember the look on his face after that one. So this is a good place to stop. This has been Uncle Swing Bastion. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and follow me by my application account. Check out my Patreon. Check out my Patreon for early access to